All right, Jason here from Septic Tank TV, and in today's video, I'm going to speak and explain all about septic tank leaks. So, if your septic tank leaks, is it legal or illegal? Well, in the next two minutes, I'm gonna give you the answer to that question. So, first of all, let me draw a septic tank. So, I'm not the best artist in the world, but let's hope, let's have a look at that. What does that look like? Ah, that's not too bad, not too bad. All right, so this is a septic tank. Well, sort of. <laughs> it's a bit... <laughs> all right, that's a bit straighter, isn't it? Okay, so imagine this is a septic tank, right? So all the wastewater from your property will leave it and it will fill the septic tank up. Most septic tanks, by the way, are about three quarters or just over full. So if your septic tank's full, like that all the time, don't worry about it, it's working fine. So what do we mean about septic tank leaks? Well, basically the septic tank is full of something called waste water. Now, although it looks blue on here, in reality, it's brown, right? Why? Because inside it, you've got poo and you've got other horrible debris that is in there. The wastewater, although it probably makes up mm, 95%, right? 90%, 95% uh, water, right? The other 5% is, 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 is poo and other debris, right? So why is that important? Well, that's important because this whole uh, system, the septic tank that's full of liquid here, basically wastewater is a, is a very uh, a romantic name. In reality, right, this is full of sewage. So that means that the water in here is toxic. It's poisonous, right? Um, it can cause cholera it can cause various diseases and death and um, so it's very very toxic right it's a pollutant right so if you and I were to drink this or it got into aquifers and water courses stuff like that it could kill people right or at least make them very ill put them in hospital so this is why septic tank leaks are frowned upon and seen as very very dangerous so so this uh, video is primarily um, uh, pointed or directed at septic tanks that were made prior, put in before 1995. See, a lot of the septic tanks put in there were concrete, made from concrete, or they were, <coughs> excuse me, made from bricks and mortar, or they were made from breeze blocks. And what happens over time is that concrete, bricks and mortar, and breeze box, they crumble, they break down, they disintegrate. And so what happens then is that the wastewater from the septic tank will make its way out through the walls of the septic tank into the soil. Now, People may say, well, that's all right. I mean, it's exactly what, what happens with a soak away. You know, wastewater goes into a soak away and it soaks away, right? Well, yes, that's partly right. But the soak away, uh, uh, soak aways today have to be designed and constructed uh, into a specific design uh, that is in accordance with UK building regs, right? So it has to be, right? So let me tell you what the requirements for if you put a soak away in, right? The soak away must be, right, at least 15 meters, right, away from any river, stream, ditch, watercourse, anything like that. Why? Because if it's any nearer, the wastewater has got a chance uh, of polluting it. So if your septic tank is leaking and it's next to a watercourse or it's next to a borehole or it's near the water table, say the water table, is uh is here just under the tank let's say it's just under the tank right or there's a ditch near or a stream or a pond or anything like that this sewage water right it's just going to go straight into it so 
if you've got, um, uh, you know, if they're tapping into the aquifer um, down the road, you know, the, the water companies and, 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 and using that for drinking water, or this is going down the stream or, or, or into a pond or into your borehole that you're using as for drinking water, then this is going to poison you, right? And so this is why uh, septic tank leakage is now frowned upon. In fact, it's not just frowned upon, right? It was frowned upon prior to uh, January the 1st, 2020. If your septic tank leaks, it is now 100%. Oh, let me just uh, dry that. Let me just dry that because that is not uh, dry. That's why the red pen. Your septic tank will now be 100% illegal if it leaks, right? No ifs, no buts. That's what the new rules and regulations, part of the new rules and regulations that came out on the 1st of January 2020. If your septic tank leaks, then it must be replaced with a new septic tank. All the new septic tanks are made from plastic or fiberglass. They're made to an EN uh, uh, standard, a British standard, which means that they are watertight, they're sealed. And so if you suspect your septic tank is leaking, then um, the first thing I would advise you to do is, is contact the environmental agency or UK building regs. You could even get um, a septic tank consultant around to do a test on that. But, um, you'll find that uh, <laughs> they're not, the government agencies are, are for the, obviously for the right reason, are not as tolerant about leaks as they used to be. So there you go, that was just a little basic video on uh, whether septic tank leaks are now legal or illegal. So I hope that's helped. So listen, thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video today. If you'd like to see more of me and these videos, then just go to Septic Tank TV and type that into Google or see my YouTube channel. But listen, thank you very much for what. Thank you very much for watching. You take care and I will speak to you soon.